Hey guys, welcome to the channel Market Uncharted. Today I have a really special video just for you. And today what I'm going to discuss with you is quite simple. On a weekly and daily basis, right, I need to check and do my checks as an investor and I do my research and I search all information around the world for my investments, right, in a few websites, in a few applications, in a few tools. And today, basically, I just want to share with you what I use. Please be aware I'm not a financial investor, so everything that you'll see are my personal views and what I do for me. Of course, I strongly encourage you to do your own checks. Make sure that if you don't uh, um, quite agree with my tools, do your own research. But this is just my idea. And what we are going to do today is quite simple. I'm going to show you uh, what I do as an investor and then we'll go to every one of the websites and see. Uh, what can be done and what type of information is available on each and every one of them. So let's start. Uh, first, this is my top apps. Okay, Market Watch, the first one. Market Watch is really important uh, uh, website. This is the website where you can see all the market uh, uh, news on a daily basis. It's constantly being renewed. It's really important for have a macro eco economy view of the world to understand also for your own country the most important news. Financial news is really really important. So this is my go to website on a daily basis is really crucial for me. Then we have Coinbase. And Coinbase is really specific, uh, ladies and gentlemen. This is for uh, the investors in cryptocurrencies. So my crypto portfolio is all in Coinbase. When you can buy and sell whatever the altcoins you want to do, this is where I, I keep and hold all my portfolio. Of course, there is another ones that you can trade, for example, Bitcoin, which is Binance uh, application. There is a lot more and I strongly encourage you to search the one you wish to, to fit your or investment needs but this is the one I use then we have also Yahoo Finance which is quite similar to market watch but it's also important to have a variety of this type of websites because you never know when the the break the breaking news is, is coming so I, I have it parallel to my market watch as well as thinking alpha the only difference is that Seeking Alpha for me, I strongly like it because they have a lot of opinions and views on stocks, for example, and ETFs. And you can also search a little bit more about uh, uh, the ratios and the financial information about the company. Then we move on to TradingView. And TradingView is slightly different from the first ones. This is the tool I use for my technical analysis. So the first ones that we are talking are more for the fundamental analysis, the ratios, the financial information. Trading view, I use it to see the graphs, to see the technical analysis, to try to understand the, t the trends of my stocks, of my ETFs, of my Forex, of my index funds, whatever I, I wish to trade. And this is where I analyze the graph. I analyze with some of the ratios that you can put it and all the information that you can put around technical analysis in the graphic and you can see the trend of, of the of the stock or whatever you are trying to to invest so this is my go-to for the technical analysis then a really really important one which is Morningstar and Morningstar is also really important to search information regarding for example, a, a, a ETF that you wish to trade or an index fund that you used to trade where you want to see the holdings of that ETF, the holdings of that index fund, the ratios around it, the performance around it, uh, the analysts view about it. So Morningstar is really, really crucial. It's also uh, uh, one of that uh, on a daily basis, every time I wish to trade, I go here first. I really trust that information. Investing.com, quite similar with Market Watch, Seeking Alpha, also Yahoo Finance. Again, I just like to have several uh, open at the same time because we never know where it came. Investing.com is also a cool app to have on the phone. Uh, important also on trading view, I forgot to mention. Important also on the trading view is that, for example, my my watch list, my future uh, uh, investments that I want to do, trading view also have an app on the phone that I ha can have my watch list to check the stock prices, the ETF prices, whatever, at any time. 
then forex factor this is more focused for the forex traders the guys that the guys that only want to trade currencies the fx factory is really important because on a daily basis they show us the important news that will impact our currencies for example if i want to trade euro dollar this is the place that i need to be all the time they give a weekly schedule so you can see if the government is changing the interest rate or for example the uh, the 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 main guy in in ecb or the fed if they are going to discuss anything related to 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 impact the economy it's going to be on forex factor and for example the retail sales on the united states i'm going to do a specific video on forex factor information because i think it's really broad and really important for all of us but for now just keep this in mind forex factor for every trader in fx is really really crucial then I have Bloomberg. And why do I have Bloomberg when I have so many others that always show the financial information? It's because Bloomberg can give us a really cool insight that the others don't. Because Bloomberg has access to former traders, really important people in the hedge fund industry, in the investment banking industry, that they, they can share their views with Bloomberg. So time to time, you'll see information from an ex-trader or ex-manager manager in the index fund for example, sharing their views on, on the market, sharing their views on the future of the stocks or whatever the product they are trying to see. And this is really important because as it's so traditional, this is where uh, I started to really pay attention to cryptocurrencies, for example, was when Bloomberg, such a traditional website regarding stocks, was giving such highlights to these cryptocurrencies. Then I, I started to check. So that's why it's really important because it's more traditional. It shows the insights of uh, ex-traders and already uh, big CEOs and really, really important. And final for me, also Central Trade, this is just an example of a broker uh, I, I of course I strongly encourage you to do your own search in Google about other brokers in your, in your area this is the broker I, I choose this is the broker that I like it, this is really important for example if you want to start investing to download the demo account which is not not real money but you can try to see how the platform works etc etc then you can actually open a real account and trade trade all the products that you can imagine from FX to index to ETF to act to shares it's whatever you wish to trade in this platform it's possible but just to give you an idea ladies and gentlemen this is the apps that on a daily basis every time i wake up this is the apps i, I need to search and now let's move on and see one by one why do we check these applications why this is important in this case for me and i hope this start to be important for you as well so let's move on so moving on to the applications now themselves and see a little bit why do I use them? Why do I feel this is important? So let's go one by one. First, Market Watch, as I was saying, really important one to have the latest news, the latest information, opinions about the markets, also quotes on the markets. You can see here on the top left, you can see all my quotes if I want to see the Europe, um, index I have also directly the, the related to FX also cryptocurrencies right here you can see uh, again Bitcoin today going above the 29,000 amazing remarkable uh, quote for Bitcoin but this is what you need to check also here on the top right you have the latest news all the time this is really important sometimes you can see here a market snapshot here below as well and you see all around the world. So this is why Market Watch is definitely something that I need to keep in touch on a daily basis. Really important for me. Uh, I strongly encourage you to check this website. It has a lot of insights, a lot of information. You can see here opinions, not only about the US market, but overall. Moving on to Coinbase. Coinbase, again, it's specific for uh, uh, cryptocurrencies, right? So you can see here the quotes, in this case, is exchanging for euros, the quotes of all the cryptocurrencies. And this is where I wish to buy and sell all my cryptocurrencies and my portfolio. Here, I strongly encourage you to come see all the products they have available, the prices they, they, they trade. And if you wish to, to invest in cryptocurrencies, this is what I use. I strongly encourage you to do your own research, as I said before it's really important 
Then moving on to Yahoo Finance, uh, slightly different from Market Watch. Still one the important ones that I, I, I keep track on. This is uh, slightly different, but from time to time it has really important news. As also some things, for example, here we see the 12 stocks this year that Warren Buffett invested in. And if you want to, to, to check, you can always click, see the news and it's important it's important to 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 keep track of what's going on uh, sometimes as you can see here is redirecting you to other websites but again yahoo finance for me is really important one and you can see here now for example the top 12 stocks that uh, warren buffett like to trade and the sectors so this is important one because if you follow these guys if you uh, see the value on this type of investors then you see here the information that this type of websites show to us seeking alpha is slightly different in the sense that it's more uh, focus also on the financial fundamental side of the the investments and you can see here if i want ideas about dividends or reits or etfs they have etf analysis as well they talk about strategies they have stock ideas if i want to go long if it, which means i want to buy and hold they can share all the information you can see here not only economy but gold commodities forex real real straight have also editor pickups cryptocurrencies as you can see this is really really important plus the news as all the others but this is more important for me in the sense that has a lot of information this is a community that also it's present in seeking alpha and they have their information they they have their opinion so if you are an investor and you want to see what generic the 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 investors are thinking seeking alpha for me it's one of the top 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 websites to see on a daily basis then we have market uh, sorry trading view and why trading view this is as i was saying where i, I analyze the graphics the the technical analysis part where for example we are seeing here Apple, you can see the, the, the up trend of Apple during the last few years, really one of the best companies in the world. But for example, for me, it's really important because I can define trending lines, I can see support levels, I can do my technical analysis, quite simple, quite important for everyone that believes in technical technical analysis this is really important they have here all the type of information that you need like as a volume you can put the, the rce or the macd the the fibonacci uh, levels everything it's possible here in trading view is really really complete types of graphics have everything we want and totally free this is also important to mention totally free that's why i use it on a daily basis i really feel it's important Morningstar, as I was seeing, I do more in terms of research. This is what I care, right? Research on mutual funds, ETFs, bonds, stocks. They have also their views on the best investments. So for me, as Seeking Alpha, Morningstar, I just show you on the road the three most important for me, which is Seeking Alpha, Trading View, and then Morningstar for more specific research and, and information about specific ETFs or mutual funds, index funds stocks as well it's really important you can see here information about etfs you can read news that go to 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 directly to etfs or impact etfs you can see also uh, some information that they put as the ratings and the picks and this is important for me because i always i'm always trying to find uh, 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 important investments on a daily basis as you can see sometimes you need to to subscribe to in order to to see the full information but they have quotes they 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 see for example for for the us if they they track as a gold morning star rating means they fully believe in it the ratios are good the financials are good so again if you like it this is really important
Investing.com goes a little bit with market watch, right? This is really important. Give us the main news. And for me, it's just a, 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 something else that I, I like to show. It has the economic calendar as Forex Factory, but it's more related to stocks. So as you can see, a lot of the information they are trying to say almost the same. But for me, it's always important to keep track and follow all of these ones. Then for Forex Factor, this is really cool as well. Forex Factor, as I was saying, more specific for FX. You can see here the, the market calendar for today, and you can see all the quotes for the Forex uh, currencies. Uh, also news, also uh, information about cryptocurrencies. And again, really, really important for, for me to, to keep track. Bloomberg which I was saying it's more insightful, has a lot of opinions, more information, uh, has other products that, for example, Morningstar doesn't track, as, for example, futures, has fixed income as well, they go for watch lists as well, the sectors, so they, they, they go macro economy as well, for example, they still have here information about the elections 2020 for the US, so again, really full information, I strongly encourage you please come here take a look on this website is really really important they have all type of news macro economy news all around the world it's really important finally central trade i strongly encourage you www.centraltrade.es you can see what they do what type of service they have search as formation training for example if you want to do a stock course or fx investment course this is something here that I really uh, strongly encourage you to take a look to see if this is something important for you. Um, again, I'm not a financial advisor, but it's important for you guys to know what is out there, what can we do, what type of information, because nowadays we have a lot of information present in the websites and it's important for us to know, check the advantage of it, check if it makes sense for you as a as an investor, as your risk uh, profile. And this is, this is really, really important. So guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you have enjoyed it. it we, I think it was really insightful for all of us to understand the main apps that we are using. But don't forget, knowledge is not power. Knowledge is potential power. Execution is everything. What does that mean for us in this video? It's basically that I have shown you all the apps that can give you the knowledge, but then we need to actually have an action on it. But anyway, thank you so much, guys, for uh, watching this video together with me. It was really uh, a pleasure. Uh, if you like it, please uh, subscribe our channel for more content. And don't forget, just like the markets, we will not rest. Thank you so much. Thank you.